The following is a production of New Mexico State University. Farmers use special chemicals called pesticides and fertilizers in their fields and on their crops. By controlling the weeds and insects and by nourishing the plants, these chemicals help the farmer's crops grow. When they're used carefully, farm chemicals are good for plants. But people must be very careful when they work with chemicals. They're good for plants, they're good for crops, but they are not good for you. Most often, chemicals are sprayed on the fields. The mist or fog covers every part of the plants and the soil. By using a spray, fewer chemicals get the job done. This spray can irritate your skin or your eyes. If it gets into your mouth, it could make you feel sick. Look at that spray. It looks cool and refreshing. It's keeping bugs off the chili and weeds from the hay. But get out of the field. Stay out of the spray. What's good for the plants is not good for you. Many types of equipment are used to spray chemicals on crops, from airplanes that fly overhead, to tanks pulled by tractors, to hand sprayers. While you might be interested to see how these machines work up close, the machines themselves can be dangerous, and the amount of chemicals they hold can be harmful for you. Don't play near equipment, don't play with equipment, stay away from places where chemicals are stored. Insecticides, herbicides, fertilizer, yuck. They kill the bad bugs, they're good for the crops, but they're not good for you. Sometimes farm chemicals are put in the irrigation water. They treat the plants and soil as the water travels through the fields. Water in the fields, and especially in the ditches, can be very dangerous. So don't play in the ditches, don't drink that water. Let the plants have it. They need it to grow. The water's not clean from sprays from machines. It's good for the plants, but it's not good for you. When you go to the farm with your parents, make sure that all those who go into the fields wear clothing that covers their skin. Wear shirts with long sleeves and long pants. Never wear sandals and shorts. For your feet, boots are best. Canvas shoes or tennis shoes should be washed often. When you go to the fields, wear long sleeves, pants, and shoes. Short sleeves, shorts, and sandals are strictly taboo. Let the chemicals touch only the bugs and the weeds. They'll kill the bad bugs. They'll wilt the bad weeds. They help the plants grow, but they're not good for you. Never eat in the field. Always keep your dinner and your drinking water away from the field and the chemicals. Be sure to wash your hands before you eat. And if you bring any vegetables home with you, make sure they're washed before anyone eats them. Wash your hands when you eat. Wash fruits that you eat. Wash the veggies you pick from the fields. Chemicals belong on the plants and the crops, not on your lunch or on the food you munch. Chemicals help the plants grow. They're good for the crops, but they are not good for you. Remind your parents when they come home from working in the fields that they should change their clothes and shower right away. Chemicals that may be on their clothing or their hands and faces can give them a rash or even give you a rash. Tell dad not to hug you till he takes off his work clothes. Spray from the crops could get passed on to you. He'll shower and change clothes because he surely does love you and he wants to make sure you stay healthy and safe. Pesticides stick to the plants and his clothing. They're good for the plants, but they're not good for you. What should you do with those dirty work clothes? It's best to store them outside the house until they can be washed. Keep the work shoes and work boots outside the house too. Because dad's clothes may have chemicals on them, you don't want to touch them. Even dad and mom should be careful when they touch these dirty clothes. And dad should not wear these clothes again until they've been washed in hot water with detergent and bleach. Don't wear those again, dad. Wait till you wash them. 
Please wash them in hot, hot water with bleach. Use bleach and detergent and hot water to wash them. Washing sprays off the clothes makes it safer for you. Agricultural chemicals are much like the cleaners or other chemicals that your parents use around the house. They must be handled very carefully. It's a good idea to stay away from places where chemicals are stored, whether it's the barn or under the kitchen sink. Never use any chemicals unless an adult says it's okay and is there to help you. Always throw away empty chemical containers. Never refill or reuse them. Stay away from the sprays and the bottles and barrels. They should only be used by adults with great care. Help teach your little brothers and sisters. Sprays are good for plants, but they're not good for you. Be careful with chemicals. They're good for plants, but they're not good for you. Remember, stay away from spray and spraying equipment. Don't drink or play in irrigation water. Stay away from stored chemicals. Never reuse chemical containers. Wear a long sleeve shirt, long pants, and boots. Protect your food from chemicals. Wash your hands before you eat or drink. And wash produce before you eat it. Shower and change your clothes right after work. Handle soiled clothing carefully. Wash soiled clothing in hot water with detergent and bleach. Don't wear soiled work clothes again until they've been washed. Make safety an everyday practice. Teach your family and friends how to use farm chemicals wisely. The preceding was a production of New Mexico State University. The views and opinions in this program are those of the author and do not necessarily represent the views and opinions of the NMSU Board of Regents.